That's because this Delta variant is far more contagious, according to health officials. And they say it also went from being pretty much non-existent to the more dominant strain in just a couple of months. Health officials with UAB say the Delta variant is particularly frightening because people who are infected with the variant can infect other people with only limited contact. They say the virus protein has evolved to where it can attach to someone's respiratory lining and stick to it, which means the variant can attach to somebody's respiratory system within five to 10 seconds of having contact with an infected person. Officials do say there is somewhat of good news when it comes to the variant, but particularly for those who are vaccinated. There have been some suggestion in laboratory experiments that that variant might be evolving some resistance to the vaccines, but in general, really robust data to say that at least right now, if you're vaccinated, you should largely be protected against the Delta variant. Dr. Marazzo says we are starting to see the number of coronavirus hospitalizations back on the rise and to avoid seeing from what we saw last summer and to stay completely normal, we should get vaccinated. Live in Huntsville, Ashley Carter, Way 31 News.